I worked in Kilwa in uh, Lindi district in the southern part of Tanzania uh, with the sesame, which is an internationally driven uh, value chain crop. Uh, the changes that happened with uh, sesame are really related to the marketing. Uh, initially, sesame was largely uh, marketed through the cooperatives, but then the district council uh, decided to introduce a, a new system uh, whereby private traders were welcome to buy the sesame from the farmers. And this is because the cooperatives were not working properly. So the district council uh, invited uh, private uh, traders to buy the sesame. But the key issue here was that uh, the district council had to set up uh, a minimum price uh, for each season. So this was an, an incentive or an attraction to the farmers to produce, but also for the traders to come in the, in the district uh, to buy the sesame. So this in a way by itself really increased the production of sesame in the area, but also increased the connectivity uh, between the Kilwa district and, and the neighboring areas where uh, they could buy the sesame, and especially in Dar es Salaam, where was the, which is the exporting point for sesame. So this is a really a good example where a district council can really intervene in value chains and really improve the production of the crop, but also the livelihoods of the farmers through this connectivity between the very remote areas like Kilwa and Dar es Salaam city.